Okay, let's continue to factor polynomials completely. Again, we're going to have to look for a greatest common factor in this case of all of these terms. And the greatest common factor here will be 7, because that's the greatest common factor between 21, 35, and 14. So you can take out a 7. And also, for all the variables, I can actually take out an m times n because that's common to all these elements over here. So 21 actually let me just write it on the side here 21 m cubed n divided by 7 m n 21 divided by 7 is just 3 so I get a 3 over there the n's cancel out and m cubed divided by m is just m squared. So I have 3m squared. And negative 35m squared n, negative 35 divided by 7 is negative 5. m squared divided by m is just m, and the n's cancel out. And finally, negative 7mn divided by 7, sorry, did I say 7? <laughs> negative 14mn divided by 7 mn will be negative 2 and that's it the m and the m cancel out so do the n's and at this point are we done? no we're not because we can actually factor this trinomial but to get started we're gonna have to look for two numbers that multiply to whatever 3 and negative 2 multiply to in this case that's 6 or rather negative 6 and two numbers that add up to whatever multiplies to the m, which is negative 5. So those two numbers will be negative 6 and positive 1. So I can split up the negative 5m into negative 6m plus 1m. The negative 2 comes down below, and so does the 3m squared. And the 7mn is just waiting outside. Then over here, I'll just open square brackets here instead. And I can factor by grouping. Between these two elements, I can pull out a 3m. 3m squared divided by 3m is just m. Negative 6m divided by 3m is just negative 2. And over here, between 1m and negative 2, the greatest common factor is just 1. So I can put a 1 over here and multiply by m minus 2. Square brackets again. And why is that? Because 1m divided by 1 is just m. Negative 2 divided by 1 is just negative 2. And there's still the 7mn over here. Now the final step will be to combine 3m and 1. So we have 3m plus 1 and multiply by m minus 2, which is the common binomial there that, they, that we have. Now we have that we're completely done factoring by grouping, and I'll just write the final answer while barely having any room <laughs> down here. 7mn times 3m plus 1 times m minus 2 is the final answer, and that's it.